everybody. It's uh, Josh. How are you guys doing today? Happy Saturday afternoon. Hey, I just wanted to uh, jump on and uh, chat with you guys a little bit as I'm driving uh, home from showing a, a, a few houses. So a couple things that have been, been uh, tossed around lately. I haven't done a live video in a while. And I just wanted to uh, chat with you guys a little bit about uh, some stuff that's been said lately and uh, kind of try to debunk it a little bit and try to get you guys uh, in the right frame of mind on things. First off, the one that I've heard from people that have their home on the market, not actually with us, or even people that uh, we have helped sell their homes or are currently helping them, uh, why their home's not selling. Um, so a couple of the biggest things um, are gonna be, your, the reason it's not selling are location, um, desired, desired location, uh, school districts are huge in this in this county. Um, Especially when you get down to the Temecula Marietta area, it, it gets it gets really picky. Uh, price is always a huge one, uh, and then another one is the condition of the house. Um, nothing. Homes are sitting on the market right now, at least 30 days. Everyone's still fighting and, and used to where we were at with homes on the market. They were flying off the market in you know less than a week. Uh, we're just not in that kind of a market anymore. Uh, homes are sitting on the market a little longer. Uh, people are very calculated how, with how they're buying homes. They're not buying out of extreme necessity and just buying whatever they can just to get in. Um, they're very calculated. People that are buying right now are very specific. They don't want to buy just because. They want a certain features. They want certain locations. So it's going to slow things down. Um, so. That doesn't mean that the, the market's not healthy. Um, doesn't mean that homes aren't selling uh, because they are. So, yeah. So that that's the biggest. Those are the biggest things to think about with that is just your price, your location, the condition of the house um, are some huge driving forces on why why it, it sits or sits longer. Um, and when it comes to the market and everybody talking about what's happening and what what's going to happen. Nobody really knows. Nobody really knows. Um, all I all I do know is that interest rates are insanely low. Uh, our economy is health, healthy. I just heard on the news this morning that uh, our stock market closed the, the highest it's, it's been since like the 30s. So those are all good indicators that our economy is strong, it's healthy, um, and that we're we're doing great. Uh, there's all kinds of great loan programs out there right now too. So um, rates are low, economy's healthy, and there's great programs for first-time home buyers and anyone trying to upgrade. So um, yeah, you guys, I just wanted to jump on and just kind of chat about those things real quick and just kind of let you guys know that uh, it's a good time. Um, it, it's probably the, as, a, as a buyer that's not having to sell anything, it's an amazing time for you because there's, there's there's good inventory out there. Um, you have a good leverage for some negotiation. Uh, so Make sure you put a good person behind you um, to help you negotiate and try to get you the best deal possible. Uh, if you guys have any questions about any of these topics or anything else, uh, give me a, me a call or Tori a call. All right, you guys. Have a great rest of your Saturday, and I'll talk to you soon. See ya.